Hello everyone, welcome back to the Russ Ride channel. My name is Russ, and on this channel I'll give you tips to increase your earnings and performance on rideshare companies and delivery companies. Today, who cares about food deliveries? I sure do. What tool is already in the function of the app that the company's not using for your benefit to increase your tips? Messaging. You can use text messaging to increase your tips. About a year ago, I do remember hearing from another rideshare driver on YouTube about how to increase your tips by sending a canned text message with every food delivery at the start of your order. I did use that to great success to get reviews as well as tips, and I did modify the message slightly. Additionally, Bentley Coop from DoorDash Diaries recommends that at handoff in person, you tell the customer, oh, the app may get, ask for a review. I'd appreciate it if you can give me five stars. Thank you. And that started me thinking, you know what? What if I adjust the text message and use it on other food delivery companies as well, not just Uber Eats? I did that on DoorDash, and in one afternoon, my low score of 4.2 went up to a 4.6. And you should watch Bentley Coop's videos to see why your ratings are important. I encourage you to replace my name with yours and adjust the message as you see fit. Send the message at the start of any food delivery, and what this does, it shows you care, it relates that you're a human being, and that you want to get their food quickly, it opens communication, and without being overt, it will increase your tips because they're going to remember you at handoff. And additionally, I would also recommend uh, Bentley Coop's advice for saying, hey, the app may ask you for a review. I'd really appreciate it if you give me five stars. Thank you. Have a good day. Hello, this is Russ with DoorDash. I will be there soon. Later, don't forget to rate my service. It's a pleasure serving you. Thank you, Russ. Let's break down this message. The first part, you're giving your name and the company you work for. Next, you're showing the urgency that you have and the desire to get them their food quickly. Next, you're kindly asking them for a rating. It puts it in their mind that they should rate you. Finally, you're thanking them and you're humbling yourself by saying, it's a pleasure to serve you. That's right, we're in a customer service industry, and by overtly saying, serve you, you're humbling yourself, and you're showing that you're grateful for their being a customer. And ideally, they're gonna reward you in the form of tips for that. What I do is I'll send an email to myself, one email per company. So for example, on Uber Eats, I would take that canned message, and say, hi, this is Russ with Uber Eats. And then the rest is the same. And then I have another email for DoorDash. And then at the beginning of the food delivery, once I have the food and I'm in my car, I start the delivery, but before I start driving, I'll load up that text message. And if I'm only a few minutes away, I'll send it right then. But if not, I'll let it stay in the queue. And again, I've already started navigation, so I know where to go. And then I'll let that message just hang there and tell them about a few miles away or about five minutes, and then I'll send it. That way you're never texting and driving and you're being safe. At handoff, I still follow Bentley Coop's advice and ask for that rating. And then finally, a bonus tip. Be polite to the restaurant workers. Again, if you share your displeasure, if they're behind or going slow, yes, time is money for you, but they don't care. So, it does no good to be frustrated or show displeasure to them. Instead, thank them and say nice things to them. I'm sure they're going to appreciate it. They work hard, and it's good to be recognized. And again, they're probably not getting tipped for that order they're putting together for you. So, be kind to them. If you found this tip helpful, let me know in the comments below. So, let's make it happen. Remember, no excuses. Get out there and see an increase in your ratings and your tips. Thank you, and I'll see you in my next video.